Hebrews 12 and 17. For ye know how that afterward when he would have inherited the blessing, he was rejected. For he found no place of repentance, though he saw it carefully with tears. Shalom. This is Brother Matazal. I'm about to do a quick lesson on um, why Esau won't, won't have mercy in the kingdom. But before I open up, I want to give all praises and glory and honor to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, Bashem Rakak Kadash, double honors to our apostles and our elders of Great Millstone that rule well. Peace and salutation to all you Akim out there that's laboring in this truth, truth and sincerity. All right. Let's get right on into it. This is Hebrews 12 and 17. He says, For ye know how that afterward, when he would have inherit, inherited the blessing, he was rejected. For he found no place of repentance, though he saw it carefully with tears. So the, the Most High is not going to uh, grant uh, Esau uh, mercy. You know, even though he's going to uh, 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 search and cry out to the Heavenly Father with tears, begging for mercy. And the reason why is because, you know, uh, um, Matter of fact, we just let the scriptures speak on it. Let's go to the book of uh, Ezekiel, chapter 35, and start at 1. This is the book of uh, Ezekiel, chapter 35, verse 1. He says, Moreover, the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Mount Seir, and prophesy against it. And, and he says, and say unto it, thus say of the Lord power, behold, O Mount Seir, I am against thee, and I will stretch out my hand against thee, and I will make thee most desolate. And the most high is against Esau, Edom, man. But prophecy has to play out first. You know, things have to happen. That's why this devil's still in rulership, man. You know, but, the, uh, but slowly but surely, you know, he's coming down out of power, man. You know, the Heavenly Father is going to bring him down out of power and put him in his rightful place, man, at the bottom where he belongs, man. He's a base man, and he's going to be base in the kingdom of heaven. He's going to be our slaves uh, for uh, for thousands, for 4,000 years, man. And then after that thousand years, he's going to be he's going to be done away with, man. <laughs> he said, uh, Slakia, um. Uh, Verse 4, I'm, I'm going to read verse 3 again. So like it. He said, and say unto it, thus saith the Lord, power, behold, O Mount Seir, I am against thee, and I will stretch out my hand against thee, and I will make thee most desolate. Yeah, the Most High is going to make him most desolate, man. He said, I will lay thy cities waste, and his cities are going to be laid waste. They're going to be destroyed with, nu nu with nuclear thermal fire, man. He said, and thou shalt be desolate, and thou shalt know that I am the Lord. Right. And they are going to know that he the Lord, man. Because the Lord going to come, too, with, with his angels and the chariots, man. Like the scriptures say, like a whirlwind. And uh, in fact, it's like, yeah. I'll get back to that. Let me just finish reading where I'm at. This is verse five. He says, "Because thou hast laid, it's like you, because thou hast had a perpetual hatred, and has shed the blood of the children of Israel by force of the sword, by force of the sword, in the time of their calamity, in the end, it's like you, in the in the in the time that their iniquity had an end, right? In the time of when the uh, slavery." When we came up out of the slavery that we were in for over 400 years, um, you know, this devil, he has not, you know, um, had mercy. He has not taken his foot off the children of Israel's neck, man. Instead, you know, he actually furthered the affliction. You know, he, he still got his, uh, his, his foot on our neck right now, man. You know, instead of sending us back home and not putting us in our, putting us in our lands, and paying reparation for what he for uh for what we've done we built this place we built up america with um blood sweat and tears 
and have not been paid for it, man. We did free labor. You know, it, actually, it wasn't even free labor because we paid by blood and sweat and tears. <laughs> but he didn't. He didn't give us a. Uh, 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 he didn't pay. He didn't pay his uh, uh, reparation for it, man. He's a merciless devil toward us, man. You know, you got other countries like uh, uh, where, where those fake Jews they give them reparations for the Holocaust. Still to this day, man. You know, uh, the Jap uh, Japanese, Japan, you know, they get reparations, man. Hell, even the LGBTQ community, whatever they call it, man, they 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 get reparations. You know, but but us so-called Negroes, no, nah, man. See, see, this is why this devil ain't going to have mercy from the Heavenly Father, man. You know, instead, this is what he did to our people. He set up uh, drugs and and, 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 and uh, gangs and put uh, diseases in our community. And um, he's uh, split up the, uh, uh, our families. He puts uh, snares all up in our communities, man. Then he, he and then Jake go out there and start selling drugs and get locked up, be put in prison. And then and on top of that, he gives uh, 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 Jake long sentences, man. No mercy, man. For for one dime bag of crack cocaine, you can get in, in the state of Illinois, you can get anywhere from six to 30 years. And, and if, if the judge having a bad day, he'd give you them 30 years, man. You know, this devil don't have no mercy on Jacob, man. You know, and then when you do your time, you come out and you look for a job. You try to get a job and get yourself together. You know, so okay, you know, you got it made up in your mind. You ain't gonna do that no more. You you gonna just try to work a job, but you can't because this devil got to set up with hire you because now you a felon. You know, so so now what Jake do? They go back to the streets because you got to make money. You got to you know pay bills. You got to provide for your family. So you go back to the street selling drugs again or stealing or robbing, whatever you was doing. You know, this this is what this devil has done to, to the children of Israel. That's why the Most High is not going to have mercy on them, man. Let me uh, finish up reading this. Uh, uh, this is uh, verse 5. He said, because thou has had a perpetual hatred. See, and it's a perpetual hatred, meaning like it's ongoing. He's not. He has not stopped. He has not stopped hating you. Even to this very day right now, man, this devil hates you, man. You know, if anything, he want to kill you. And he want to lock you up in his prison system. That's why they That's why they uh, uh, put these drugs and, and AIDS and all these other different STDs, you know, in our communities, man. That's why they put their grocery stores in our communities, man, and, and make the food that's good for you cost too much. And all the stuff that's not good for you, they make it really cheap. So you can't even eat healthy. This devil know what he's doing, man. And then the produce that he give you is it ain't no good. It's it's they give it's it's about to spoil, you know, or or be rotten. He said, uh, Salakia, uh, because thou has had a perpetual hatred and has shed the blood of the children of Israel by force of the sword, and in the time of their calamity, in the time of their and it's like in the time that their iniquity had an end. Therefore, as I live, saith the Lord, power, I will prepare, I will prepare thee unto blood, and blood shall pursue thee. Sith thou hast not hated blood, even blood shall pursue thee. Right, since this devil didn't hate what he was doing, he ain't have a conscience, you know, he was just doing it, man. He didn't care, you know. <laughs> So now Esau going to reap what he sowed, man. You know, he's going to reap what he sowed. He sold, he sold uh, murder and, 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 and rape and robbery. He's going he's gonna, to uh, uh, he's gonna be put to death, man. He's going to get exactly, you know, uh, what, he, what he dished out. You know, he didn't, dish, he, he didn't give out mercy, man. Matter of fact, let me get this real quick and come back to that. This is uh Yahweh Shah said this in the book of um uh, Matthew chapter five. Um uh, let me see. Bear with me. Yeah, this is uh Matthew chapter five, verse seven. He said, Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. So so if you if you be merciful, then the Heavenly Father, you know, he he'll give you mercy, man. 
So you got to basically, uh, uh, you got to, uh, uh, whatever you give out is what you get back, man. Whatever you reap is what you, whatever you sow is what, uh, what you reap. Okay. But Esau, what he, re what he, uh, what he sold out was, uh, was, a uh, 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 death and murder, man. This is uh, going back to uh, the book of Ezekiel. So I can. Yeah. This is Ezekiel uh, 35 and 6. He said, Therefore, as I live, saith the Lord, power, I will prepare thee into blood, and blood shall pursue thee. Since thou hast not hated blood, even blood shall pursue thee. Thus will I make Mount Seir most desolate, and cut off from, from it him that passeth out, and from them, like it, and him that returneth. And I will fill his mountains with his slain men in the hills and in the valleys and in in all thy rivers shall they fall in Slaki that are slain with the sword i will make thee i will make the uh, perpetual Slaki i will i will make the perpetual desolations and thy city shall not return and ye shall know that i am the lord because thou hast said, these two nations are it's like, it, and these two countries are mine, and we will possess it, whereas the Lord was there. So they, yeah, they're talking about those two lands. That's talking about uh, those two nations and those two lands. It's talking about the uh, northern kingdom and the southern kingdom of Israel, man. And he said, there, it's like it. Therefore, as I live, say of the Lord, power, I will even do according to thine anger and according to thy envy, which thou hast used out of thy hatred against them. And I will make and I will make myself known among them when I have judged thee. Right. Kind of going to make himself known amongst us, too, man. When he's judged you, man, he's going to show up. Matter of fact, to them, them fake Jews. This is in the book of Revelations uh, 3 and 9. He said, Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come and worship before thy feet and to know that I have loved thee. Right. So the Lord, gonna, uh, he going to make them all bow down at our feet, man, and worship at our feet, man, and show them. Hey, man, that he still loved us, man. Because right now, all these different nations, they think they think the, uh, 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 the Heavenly Father don't, don't care about the Israelites no more, man, because of all the hell that we catching, man, you know, up under them. They think that they have power and control over us, man. But the Heavenly Father, he, he going to show them, man, nah, man, I, I did love them, you know. And he going to put his foot on Esau's neck, man. Esau going to pay for everything that he's done to the uh, children of Israel, man. He going to get it back. The, uh, the book of Revelation say, uh, matter of fact, uh, let me get that book of Revelations uh, 18 and 6. This is the book of Revelations 18 and 6. It said, reward her even as she rewarded you and double unto her, double according to her works in the cup, which she had a fill, fill to her double. So, yeah, everything that she uh, Esau has done to us, man, he going to get it back double, man. And, and what double is, I, I don't know. Because we don't know everything this devil has done to us, man. But we will know in that day when the Lord come, man. Got another one real quick. Book of Revelations um, 13 and 9. Can never get old. This is the book of Ver uh, 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 Revelations 13 and 9. He says, if any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the patience and the faith of the saints, man. Hey, with that, man, to give all praises and glory and honor to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, Bashem, 
Rakak Kwadash, double honors to our apostles and our elders, a great millstone that rule well. Peace and salutations to all you Akim out here in the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth and truth and sincerity. Shalom.